they may very well come up with 10 different results possible that's 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 not a problem at all possible not a problem it's very much possible so there are two but questions yes, i have an objection there are two in the tone and the manner yeah. in which the entire media is being accused yeah. of being fraudster scamster yeah, yeah. there is a survey ghotala just like a 2g ghotala there is a survey ghotala and then if it is it's not stopping there going on to the family lineage of the posters that your father is that your mom is that and you know I mean, we are not used to that yeah, kind of uh, debate taking you know, it to I, that kind of the, level. The point, the that po is what the is point to be made is there's obviously, you know, the tempers are very strained and it's, it's a very tough election. And I, I can completely appreciate Yogendra Yadav that, you know, it, uh, for Arvind Kejriwal, the leader of your party, it is a make or break election. But somewhere what the point, there are two points being raised here, let's discuss it. The first point is on the use of surveys and advertising. They have a right to do it, but let's get the others in before I go to Yogendra. Dr. Sanjay called, they have a right to do it. Effectiveness. Now, when Arvind Kejriwal goes and says, like he says on radio, ki pratishat hai, etc. Do you, think it, do you think it works? Let's first debate that. Will it work? If today Vijay Goel comes and says, or Harshwardhan comes and says, or Sheila Dixit comes and says, ki pratishat, saath pratishat log mere saath hai, will it work among the people? Look, first and foremost, I think uh, you, know, you have enough experience and you've done this so many times as a media group and, and you, have, um, you have worked with half a dozen cephologists, so to say. You know that this is a dynamic issue. I don't think anybody can set up and say, this is, these are the figures, this is set in stone and this is what's going to happen. Because then you'd be dealing with a lot of Nostradamuses and you wouldn't know how to handle them. So I think the first thing that any rational, serious person who's, who's serious about electioneering would admit is that these are dynamic figures, number one. So therefore, there is no one survey which is going to be right. Number, number two, you have enough evidence that these surveys tend to be completely off the mark. Some of the people sitting there today uh, professing to be, or, or indeed are cephologists, have been wrong on, both, on many occasions. So that's another fact. The third thing is that, you see, the real issue is that there is a lack of material to communicate. Yeah. So you pick up whatever, whatever you can get and you start using whatever you can stuff into your pockets. So that lack of material, the lack of those issues, because you see, you have no experience, you have no history. So in the absence of evidence, you use promises. Let's get you, you I want Yogendra Yadav to respond. Today, Let's Yogendra Yadav respond to you. He, he, what the suggestion being made is the absence of issues and other factors, you are playing this up. And I also want you to respond to what Yashwan Deshmukh said there about the manner in which, you know, Arvind Kejriwal is responding. Arvind Kejriwal says all surveys are a joke. All polls are fixed, you know, and uh, these pe everybody else should get out of the survey business. So then should only political parties be in the survey business, Mr. Yadav? Oh, no. Let me first respond to Yashwan's question. I think it's a very legitimate question and uh, I've been a pollster. I have been at the receiving end of a lot of very unfair criticism and I completely empathize with what Yashwan is saying. And I personally do think that some of uh, the expressions that came in the heat of the moment could have been avoided. That's honestly my understanding. Mm -hmm. I don't think Arvind said everyone else should stop doing surveys. I don't think he said all surveys are fraud, all media is fraud. I mean, this he is, did say uh, that. He, he did said. say that. He but said, I do. he said, no, no, he said that. Let's be very clear. He or said no, that. I know what he, he said. He said, I and I quote in September, that. he said, these, all these polls and surveys are a joke. They are all fixed. Right. And he said, if they are true, I will quit politics. If not, all these people should get out of the survey business. Now, as I said to you, Mr. Yadav, that I know that it's a tense election for Mr. Kejriwal, but you know, now, if he wants anyone to believe that only the Amadmi Party surveys are correct and everything else is fixed, you know, I think that's taking a high moral ground which may not be appropriate. Uh, Arnav, uh, when you exactly read out the statement, the context became absolutely clear about what he said and what he did not say. But as I said, if in the heat of the moment certain harsh things have been said, I personally would regret it. I don't think it's right. I've myself been at the receiving end of a lot of unfair criticism. But just look at the situation and try and understand what's happening here. Here is a party which has no resource, very little resources, obviously no muscle power, 
obviously no patronage to offer, struggling with little idealism, little sense of whatever can be done in a very difficult situation uh, and manages to create Mr. a Mr. contest out of nothing. Mr. Joshi, after this. And then comes a heap of surveys, then come a heap of surveys, five surveys, five channels releasing surveys so, on one day. So why do Two you take channels it? presenting different data from the same thing. So, and know. what does it say? It says this is a Faltu party, this is a party which is a vote katwa party, this party has no vote. And this is when I am sitting with evidence which suggests Mr. that this Mr. is exactly the Mr. opposite. Mr. What should I do? Mr. Mr. I should Mr. Yadav, sit quietly I there and say, all right, let Mr. them do what yeah, they want to Mr. do. Mr. Yadav, no. Mr. Yadav, or should I not release no, it? No, no, one second, one second. No, no, one second. I, I take your point. But only point is, I think it is also because you, uh, you have said that, your... Before, uh, before those five channels went on air, the Aam Admi Party surveys were very much in public. They were very much in public, Arnav. Can I, can I, can and, I respond? And then, if you are, if you are advertising, no, yes, certainly, Yogen Bhai, Yogen Bhai, uh, uh, the, 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 the issue was, I mean, I, I, and I thank you very much. I hold you in high regard that you expressed regret what was being said about me and what the way it was being said about me. I thank you very much. I honor you for that. The issue was not just about that. If you are campaigning on your own surveys, I have no problems with it. As long as when you are advertising it, you are saying that this survey was commissioned by Aam Admi Party. I have no issues with that. Well, I think in no holding, in no holding, in no poster, it was written anywhere that this survey was commissioned by Aam Admi Party. Number two. Even if it is being commissioned, you have full rights to say that these are the numbers and Mr. Kejriwal is so much so popular. I have no issues. I have no issues with that. I am fine with that. But please for God's sake, let media do what media knows to do the best. And we have okay, been personally tracking your party. We were the first one to release the data in April saying you are crossing 10% mark. Yeah, yeah. You were the I, first one to say you have breached you the 15% mark. You see, you see, I can... Two days back, we were the first one to say that I, you are crossing 25 in Vidhan Sabha I, and 20% in Assembly, uh, Lok Sabha. So, please, I mean... Uh, you see, I, the question, the question is... No, no, that, question for, is... For let, let's, you, know, I, you, you cut some slack here for Arvind Kejriwal. You know, Arvind Kejriwal is not a traditional politician. He's got into politics. Maybe he's taken... been oversensitive to the service. That's one point. I just wanted Rita Bogura Joshi to come in. Yogi, no, 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 no. Yogi I'll come back. To, I'm coming to you. But no, you, Rita, Bhag by, yeah. Rita Bhaguna Joshi raised her hand while this was going on. I have a couple of minutes on the debate. Ms. Joshi. See, the campaign methodology of the Aam Admi Party is smacking a lot of arrogance. So that they've taken it for granted that they're winning the elections. See, they're very inexperienced. They do not know what the actually elector, electioneering means and how people respond when they go to the ballot pay, when they take the, uh, go to polling. See, so the question is that the people will evaluate all the parties on the basis of their performance, on their ideology, and on their, and how, and what they can promise to the people. See, the Congress party does not believe too much in surveys. We have never given too much relevance to it. Okay. So, at times you are right, at times you are wrong. But the question here is that we will go to the people with our achievements. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For 15 years, the Congress government in Delhi has worked very hard. That's it has changed the face of Delhi as infrastructure yeah, is but concerned, that social sector is concerned. So, we'll go to the people. But, but they have a right. Go to the people. But coming to the media themselves, professing that they are winning the election. Okay, now we. Who is going to be? Well, the I, I always make no, Miss Joshi. Miss Joshi, let's say this. You know, I, I'll tell you. Campaign. I'll tell. Miss Joshi. And they are, they are actually. Miss Joshi. They are actually not in grips with the reality. No, no, Miss Joshi, I'll say and this. The elections are in Miss, Miss Joshi, I'll, I'll say this. Why are they in a hurry? I will say this. Five days, and they will. I, know the I truth. will. No, but Miss Joshi, I'll say this. I'll say this despite Arvind Kejriwal saying that every other survey, including Times Now, is rubbish and fixed and all these people are fixed and paid and all the things. Despite Arvind Kejriwal saying all that, I'll still say I defend the right for Arvind Kejriwal or Yogendra Adab to have their own surveys and go public with it. I am only discussing whether this is a novel strategy which will work, which will be effective, and whether this is something which other parties are going to follow. That's all that I'm asking. Now, Yogendra Yadav has the last but word on this one. because. This is the capital city. Okay, okay. Yogendra Yadav, is this the last survey or will you have more? 
uh, we will have more, but by then we would have lost the right to go public because the Election Commission's Code of Conduct will come into being. Uh, the question is that of credibility, and you rightly said. And to my mind, the credibility of survey is about methodology of sample selection, about how you convert raw votes into vote estimates, and about yes. your sample profile. And here is the odd thing, Arnav, that media, which ought to be doing surveys, which ought to be doing high-quality survey, actually in India is very reluctant tend to talk about these three things. Very rarely do surveys reveal Mr. their sampling technique, the social profile of their sample, and how they convert raw reporting into Mr. vote share. And share is a political party which is willing to you reveal know, all that. I'll tell you one thing, Where Mr. Is Yadav. Where no, no, Mr. lie? Let's Mr. get it checked. Mr. Yes. Yadav, Mr. Yadav, one thing, one thing, Politics, which I always say this. But let's keep in mind one thing. The day, I say this with, the day the media of this country becomes accountable to a political party and a political party starts saying that I have methodology and you don't, at the end of the day the media will tell the political party you do your job and we'll do ours. We are not responsible to a political party and never will be and this is therefore, you know, this is a unique situation. I don't think, I think the media retains the right to do its own surveys but the way it does. Arnav, I'm simply the saying way it does. what I used and, to and, say and when like, I was in And the like the Congress business. Party, no, like if the BJP or the Congress Arnav, Party or I, the left I, were to ask me is, or to tell me that I have done a survey, now I think my survey is better than yours, then I'll tell the BJP and the left and the Congress Party, well, that's your survey, that's a political party survey. I do a survey, I put out my survey. And nobody's completely right, but certainly the media is not responsible to political parties and never will be. Arnav. I, I, Sanjay... But, Arnab, I'm totally only demanding sure what I used to demand when I was a pollster, yeah, and but, that's what Arvind Kejriwal but, but, but is demanding. But now, but now, but you see, now Arvind Kejriwal, that surveys should be more Arnab, transparent. Well, that's Arvind, all we are demanding. But, but Arvind Kejriwal and you are both politicians. Now, what, can what, I, can uh, I, Sanjay, call. Yeah, can I can I just uh, can I just suggest that basically it might make more sense to not accord this exercise this much importance for yeah. the simple reason is their internal problem. Okay. I don't think anybody's interested in what they think of themselves. I okay. think what we okay. want to well, know to is totally whether there are people in the city who can actually fight on the next totally, totally short of time, but, but this has been interesting. Let's decide. Let the viewer decide. Let the voter decide. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for joining me on this discussion on the news hour tonight. Thank you.